Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a cloth and paper October subscription box. I believe this is October. Um, so yeah, unless it's for November, I'm not sure, but, but I wanted to show you what came inside this box. Um, I know there are probably a lot of videos out there showing the unboxing of the subscription box, but I wanted to post one. This is my first box from Cloth and Papers. I'm super excited. I just wanted to share what comes in this box. So let's just get started. So let me just open this. Here's what it looks inside. So it has two cards. It says just some information cards about the box and and then there's this card that says you can make anything by writing and this is a inspiration test sheet for her pens because I did order the stationery box plus the pen subscription box so I have both of them in this box. It's so pretty. Love this putting into our planner. So I've actually been super getting into planning again. So I'm super excited to be subscribed. But I don't know why it took me so long. But I'm happy to be subscribed now. So let's just open this. Ooh, so first, oh my god, this is soft actually. I thought it'd be like a textured fabric kind of material. But first, we see this 2020 notebook or planner actually. So, with all the monthly tabs right there. So, it comes, oh, this is actually protected with this cardboard right here. It has a pocket, kind of, very slim looking pocket, and then this is actually closed right now, but let's see. Oh, it looks like, it has the vertical weekly layout. If you can see that. Oh, this is super handy. Unfortunately, this is spiral bound, so you can't really add anything. I mean, you can with like extra stuff, but I am looking forward to getting an A5. So, yeah, but there's this. I love the texture of this. I don't know if you can see. I thought it would be that like fabric kind of texture because of. You know how it looks but it's actually kind of like leathery feel so there's that and then it came with these three post-its these are the cool tone i don't really remember the name of these but here's this really like super like light gray color right here and then kind of like a little bit darker kind of gray kind of like a stone color and then this is like a more charcoal -y kind of color so there's that I love post-its so and I love these colors and then oh this one is stone so here is a stone page flag which looks like this color or similar so there's that. These are their kind of like transparent page flags, I believe. So my first time having these. Everything from her is actually new to me. So I'm super excited. And it came with these stickers. These like black um, gold foiled stickers. Donate, dry clean, laundry, shopping, and store return. Oh, organized right here how pretty is that i don't know oh it comes with a hundred it comes with a hundred ninety two stickers 
And then these were, I believe, a new shade that came in. The nude dots. Um, they both say nude, but they look different. I'm not sure if one is like a matte or opaque and one is a transparent one, so there's that. But oh my god, these look so pretty. I really want to pick up these and the other colors. So I might just do that next. Whenever I'm gonna place that order. Um and then it came with this um November monthly yeah um, I chose the A5 size for my planner subscription box so that's why it's an A5 size yeah I can't wait to start using this these are my first cloth and paper items like I said before so I'm super excited so that was the last of the subscription box and this is now the pen subscription box and I love the envelope, it kind of comes in like super handy. And let's see, they're just right on the box. So it came with six pens. As you can see, oh, I didn't notice this. There is this on the, this plastic bag. It says, or envelope, it says, there is luxury and simplicity. And that's kind of like, um, on all her bags like this for the pen description box. So, super pretty. I love this. I don't really know what I would use this for. Probably store my post-its in here so I can travel them with me. And also some pens in here, but it's so pretty. So, here are the six pens and let's see how oh, oops ooh this one's weighty let's see so how do I want to do this okay let's just start with this blue one so it is a snow white snow white in 0 0.5 blue pen. Yeah, I believe that's Snow White. These look like the typical pens I kind of like used before. So let's see. Let's just turn this box around so I can write on here. It doesn't really have ink. Let me see if I can zoom you in. There. Hmm. Oh, that seems like it's better. Oh, that seems way better. Okay. Do you see that? So much better. I don't know what happened there, but it's so much better now. So that was the first pen. Had a little difficulty, but all good. So here is the second pen. This doesn't really say anything, it's just a black pen. So, yeah, okay. So it's like metal <laughs> I don't know. Ooh, how pretty. It has this point. Um, not sure what the point would be. Maybe half, 0.5 still. That's a little seal. Okay, so let's try this pen. still have some seal on it. I don't know, um, 
Um, it seems like my pen still has a little bit of that seal. But... Um, I really like this pen, but I just don't know how I feel about how it writes. But more of my pen specifically. So you can see I was trying to pick off a little seal at the the ballpoint of the pen, but um, yeah, I don't know. It was still kind of having trouble. I mean, it doesn't look too bad, but I don't know, it could be better, but I love the weight of this pen. Next is this purple one. If it would focus. Um, I don't know how to say that, but that's what the name is, and it is a 0 0.5 liquid ink. This is a 0 0.5 liquid ink, so let's try this one. Ooh, it's the same, like, fine point as the first pen again. Ooh, what is that? That doesn't look good. Ooh. I love this purple pinky pen. Can you guys see? There. That's pretty good. I love this pen. Next. Next is this Monami. 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 Plus pen. Um. Is. I'm not sure what that means, but here you go. Ooh, looks like a felt tip ish. Ooh, love this for sure. Oh my goodness, I love that one. This is my favorite one so far, besides the black one, just because I like the weight of it, but this one. I love how it writes. Next, I have this pen. Um, doesn't look like there's a name on it, but it's a clicky pen. And it looks like that. Probably, probably a 0 0.7 kind of point. Ball point. Okay, so... Let's see. How pretty. It is a blue ink pen. Blue ink pen. That's that's how it writes it right there. Um it wrote pretty smooth. I really like how it looks. But I kind of prefer black ink, so I don't know how I feel about it. So, I mean, it's not bad. Totally something I would use. Last, I have this. Um, I'm not sure if this is a marker or something. doesn't really say anything besides this right here. And let's just see. Oh, it is a, it is a highlighter. And... I mean, yeah, just a, just a normal highlighter. Do these bleed? The ballpoint. These have dried by now. Well, maybe a little, a little bit smudged with the black pen. But um, yeah. I mean, this is cute. I love this kind of like pastelly yellow kind of color it's super cute so that is all for my cloth and paper subscription box i hope you enjoyed this video and found it helpful if you're new to my channel please subscribe down below and i'll see you in my next video bye